wanted to do a quick video on a recap of all the different mods I did and maybe do a um, little heads up in case you do the Pro Cycle carb mod. So I got the FMF muffler put on there and uh, not that you can see the inside of the car but you can see the extended mixture screw there and I had an issue after doing the carb mod and I'll uh, insert the video of what happened out on the trail and uh, you can watch it Damn it! So as you can see, it kind of, uh, every time I'd give it just a, a hair throttle and uh, cracked it open, it just kind of bogged down. Well, I think um, that was because you had the opening of the air box um, competing with air to the secondary here. So this was up here like this and I wasn't getting enough air to bring that slide up. <clears throat> so after scouring the internet when I had to come home early, I finally ran across a blog. I think it was on Thumper Talk and uh, the username I think was Arctic something like that. He hails from my hometown of Grand Rapids, Michigan and uh, said that he had to reroute this and he even took off this vacuum line, plugged it, and uh, has to run it on Prime. So, and I figured it was it was an air problem more than a fuel problem because um, when I was doing my testing tune, I kept playing with idle mix and it wasn't making any difference. So, <laughs> after a few hours of uh, a lot of frustration, I ended up just moving this, started it up. It was running fine. I could do throttle fine. Um, took it for a ride the next day and didn't have an issue until I uh, almost dropped the bike and that's when it started doing its thing. So my buddy that was with me at the time just said hey why don't you uh, put the choke on so I put full choke started it up cleared its throat and boom ran fine the rest of the day so um, yeah if you have that problem with ProCycle I'm not saying anything bad about ProCycle's carb kit um, because you know it really wakes the bike up it's it's like yawning and your ears popped and you never knew you had to have your ears pop that's what that carb kit does for this bike um, it really opens it up and uh, it makes a huge difference it's almost like riding two different bikes so I do recommend using the kit should big shout out to uh, ProCycle for that but just be aware if your bike has a uh, has that issue you may have to rerun this so it gets its own air supply. Um, now, that said, um, I did the opening on the airbox like Adventure Oz does, um, which uh, I'll put a link for his video in the description. Um, ProCycle actually wanted you to put a small hole here 
and a small hole down there. So I kind of did a hybrid between what ProCycle's directions say and what Adventure Oz does. So, and that's what happened. So, but anyway, so if you do have that issue, that's your thing right here. So, uh, good luck, happy riding, see you next time.